now students after discussing about the absolute value of number we are going to discuss about the properties of integer now in properties of integer the first property is close it property the first property is close it property in close it property if we add a integer with the integer then always we get the answer integer only for example if 5 add with 7 5 is a positive integer and 7 is also a positive integer 5 plus 7 then answer is 12 and 12 is also a integer in another example if we take a one positive number and one negative integers for example minus 5 plus 7 then we get the answer 2 and that also a integer so this means the closure property means if we operate the two numbers in case of addition and subtraction we always get a integer now the second property is commutative property the another name of commutative property is order property in order property we have already discussed if we change the order of the number there is no effect over the result the result will remain same for example a plus b and b plus a the result will remain same now i am going to explain this property with the help of integers if i add minus 7 with the another integer Minus five. If I solve this one, I get the result minus twelve. If I change the order of the number, first minus five, then minus seven. Now minus five plus minus 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 seven, and the answer is twelve. In both cases, we get the same answer minus twelve and minus twelve. That means. addition is commutative for integers so here we can write addition is commutative for integers in another case if we subtract two integers for example a minus b and b minus a in this case you get the same result no the result will be different how now i'm going to explain with the help of example i took a positive integer 7 then i subtract a 3 i get the answer 2 now change the order third on first and now 7 on second step and sign between them is minus here we get the result minus 4 here minus 2 and minus 4 are not equal so we can say subtraction is is not commutative for integer now we are going to discuss about the third property third property is associates associative property in associative property we will take the three numbers
if we add the three numbers and we change the group of that number then we get the same results associative property we can call the grouping property means if we change the group of the number then also we get the same result so first this property apply on the operation addition for example i add 5 plus 2 plus 3 according to the board mass first we solve the bracket 3 plus 2 5 then plus 5 we get the result here 10 i have taken all the positive integers now i change the group first 5 and 2 bound with the bracket then after add 3 5 plus 2 7 and 7 plus 3 we get the result 10 and the both result are same so here we can say addition is associative for integer Now, if we change and we take some negative integers in it, then and instead of addition, if we subtract the number, then this property applicable, let's see, 5 minus 2 minus 3. When we solve this one, from here we get the result minus 1, minus minus plus then 5 plus 1 answer 6 from the first operation we get the answer minus 6 okay students now if i change the order first 5 minus 2 then minus 3 5 minus 2 3 and 3 minus 3 0 is the both results same no so we can say subtraction is not associative for integer. Now then after we are going to discuss about the next property of and the last property of integers that is additive integers it is a fourth property additive identity in additive identity if If we add 0 to any integer, we get the number, we get the answer number itself. For example, 0 plus 18 is 18 only. If 18 plus 0, then we will get the answer 18 only. In the same way, if minus 2 plus 0 the result is the same number itself additive identity means if we add or subtract 0 from any number then the answer is integer itself so here we can write as a conclusion for any integer that is a in case 0 plus a that is we that time also we get the answer a otherwise a plus 0 in both case we get the same answer that is integer itself now students we have discussed all the four properties of integer